this is um, stuff that I used to do when I was in um, professional field. Everybody was very skeptical. But as soon as we, we uh, put this washer in the market, response from the market was, it was very amazing. It was, went just, just like that. Uh, you might not know that I worked with Professor Shane all last semester. Mm -hmm. His classes are enormously popular, uh, difficult to get into. He's one of the top teachers for learning Ooh. this. So you have to tell the computer every single stage. Otherwise, this computer wouldn't really know anything. But now, we're gonna be um, doing curve or game shape. So we've been working on 2D, which is things that you draw on sketching plane. So now it's time to make a shape on 3D space. So, hello everyone. Hi. I will be printing your files for you today. If you think about our everyday life, it's all about process. So, for example, you guys know Curie? Coffee maker Curie. It used to be when you have to make a cup of coffee, you kind of have to find a paper filter and put it in, put the water, push the uh, button and put the cup, and you have to wait and then drip, 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 drip. And someone was thinking about making a coffee and then just, just putting just one K cup. And then push the button, and then you put the cup, and you're gonna, you're gonna have the coffee. So having a cup of coffee just pretty much the same, but in terms of amount of process, people have go through dramatically shortened. And then people just love it. One of my um, expertise is focusing on process. So sometimes you don't really have to be super genius just by eliminating a certain step of process, you could make awesome products, awesome product. Ms. Evans might have been aware of our previous students complaining about JUSO project. For oh, our students, they have, I gave them the, done the juicer project. Juicer. And they have to do sidewalks modeling, the real one. And so I thought, okay, so this is, that, that's too much. So I bought mini one. You're gonna have to model this thing by using your lovely tool, the caliper. And then, again, so I was talking about all about process. You're gonna be making a cup of juice. So I want you to experience how you make your cup of juice and then improve your process. The cap, it wasn't the best, it wasn't the most effective, but it did prevent a lot of mess. No, it didn't. The stressful had stuff flying out of it. I mean, it, it doesn't fit in the cup. Okay. Supposedly sealed and everything. It, everything was lined up and I took it and it yeah. went.
My design challenge, as uh, Professor Sheen asked us to pick something to create, as you all did. I chose the USB lightning cable protectors because my kids always break them and steal mine then, so I don't have one. Overall, what I learned was um, I came into this class knowing a little bit about SolidWorks, um, but through this class I learned a lot about um, organic shapes, how to dimension and make um, really, really precise, uh, which is really important in real life. Um, and I also learned how to render um, SolidWorks files through Keyshot, which is a totally new software to me, and I found that really interesting. Here is the original juicer. Here's my redesigned juicer. The serrations are a lot more jagged, so I can grab onto the juicer. And they're barely small enough that it doesn't interfere with the fins on the reamer. So here is the new reamer. And what was the, the activity or part that you enjoyed the um, most? Like 3D printing, but I really wanted to, because like, I liked how you could, um, when you 3D printed it, you had like in your hands like something you make yourself. Okay. Um, it goes actually back to when I first saw the class. Part of the reason that I joined this class was because I saw the email from Miss Evans. It was like industrial design. That sounds rad. And I went and I looked up everything in your portfolio, of course. And sorry, sucking up a little bit. Um, I looked everything up, and I thought it was really, really cool that someone got together and, like I was talking yesterday, someone designed. Someone had an hour-long argument about the curvature of the back of this chair, and the fact that that much design goes into everything that we see and to know that there are people that their job is to be a part of that. That was a really cool thing to find out and something that I wanted to investigate and learn more about. All right, thank you all. It's actually been a, very, a pleasure to be with all of you in here and to uh, hang out with the, the faculty, but also you kiddos as eventually, which you should call you. It's been a lot of fun. And Abe, it's been okay. <laughs>